Movie buffs, welcome back to the Movie Bay. This is D. In today's video, we're going to take a look at my 10 best movies of the 70s. My 10 best movies of the 70s. I just did my 10 best of the 60s. I did, I, w I was saying nine because what I was going to do in that video, I was going to do the Rad 9 style video, but I changed and just made it 10. So it's actually 10 in that video. I kept saying nine, but it's 10. Um, so I'm doing 10, one for every year is definitely 10, not nine. So I caught that mistake, but I didn't, I'm not going to go back and re-edit the video. I did change the title, but I have 10 titles here, not nine. So we're going to do my top 10 uh, movies from the seventies, one for each year. So let's dive in and we're going to start with 1979. We're going to go with the Warriors. Come out and play. This movie is a classic. It's a banger. This movie is actually a cultural experience. That's what this movie is. Um, it's just, it's just got so many lines, so many quotes, um, so many, so much successful merchandise around this movie, video games. It's just a pop culture phenom. That's what this movie is. Next up from 1978, we're going to go with winner of five Academy Awards, Best Picture, The Deer Hunter. This is a classic movie. It's a phenomenal movie. It's a great story. It's just a great movie all around, The Deer Hunter. From 1977, we're going to go with The Car. I like The Car. I think it's a great little movie. It's a little bit cheesy today, but it's still a it's still very enjoyable. Even if you watch this movie today, it's still enjoyable. And for me, the special effects on it kind of hold up. Well, a lot of the, the special effects, a lot of the practical effects of yesteryears, they still hold up pretty good. Do they look as good as some of the new cutting edge CGI? Not really, but they still hold up pretty good. All right, we got from 1976, Carrie. Mm, excuse me, we got Carrie. From 1976. Classic. From 1975, we're going with Cooley High. Yes, Cooley High. And from 1974, we're going to go with Gene Hackman in The Conversation. Nineteen seventy three. 1973, 1973, we're going with The Exorcist. The Exorcist, this is the gold standard for horror movies. We're going to go to 1972, 1972, The Godfather. And from 1971, we're going to go with Gene Hackman in The French Connection. 1970, we're going to go to Mr. George C. Scott in Patton. I have a real fondness for this movie. So let's recap this real quick. From 1970, we got Patton. 71, we got The French Connection. 72, we got The Godfather. He's getting ready to say The Grandfather. Uh, 73, we got The Exorcist. 74, we got The Conversation. 75, we got Cooley High. 76, Carrie. 77, The Car. 78, The Deer Hunter. And 79, The Warriors. That's my favorite, my top, uh, in, my co in my collection, these are my top 10 movies from the 70s. One for each year. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.